to another video. It's Kira, and today I'm going to a curling game with my mom. So it's going to be exciting. So Canada is playing Turkey today, and then there's other games going on at the same time as well, I think. The US versus Germany, Norway versus Czech, and Italy versus Japan, I think. Don't quote me on that. But yeah, so there's going to be a lot going on and I'm really excited. This is my first time going to like a bigger sporting event since before COVID and like years before that as well. So I'm excited and yeah, let's go. back we got some chocolate eggs stay tuned for the taste test and we are back from the game now so Canada won nine to five against Turkey it was honestly a really good game and it's such a different experience watching curling in the actual rink compared to on TV now I'm not like a huge crazy curling fan I much prefer watching like hockey but it was I've been slowly getting into it, watching it with my mom every now and then, and it was really fun to go there with her today, um, but the experience was just way, way different. In the stadium, like, there's the four sheets that are going all at the same time, so there's people everywhere. It's, like, really hard to focus in on one game and, like, know what you're watching. Um, they have, like, of course, the big TVs where they're showing, like, the main games, which makes it kind of easier, but it's also different seeing like from the side perspective instead of like the top down perspective that you get from the TV. So it's like harder to see like which rocks are closest to like the center. One funny thing is like, of course, since it's like in a stadium, there's gonna be like some funny things on the screen of certain people that they don't show on TV. So they would like just pick random people from the crowd and they would put like a fort the Fortnite dance floss next to them and see if the people would do it some people would some people wouldn't and it was just funny they even did it to one of the usa players and the turkey head coach and they both did it and it was hilarious um very entertaining for sure but yeah it did not feel like a long time because it, there was just so much going on and just it was, I feel like, more entertaining than watching it on TV. So if you ever get a chance, I would definitely say, go see a curling game in person. So, you probably saw that I got these little chocolate eggs. And around Easter time, I absolutely love mini eggs. And these are definitely, like, PC brand knockoff mini eggs. So, I wanted to give them a try and rate them honestly to see if they're worth it. Because they are cheaper than mini eggs. But are they as good? Also, this packaging was super thick and took me so long to get open. There's also not very many eggs in here. See? Look like. Very similar to mini eggs. Not mini eggs. <laughs> the candy tastes a little different and the chocolate is a little different. But... If I couldn't have mini eggs and this was the only thing available, it's not that bad. I would give, so mini eggs are a 10 out of 10. I would give these PC milk chocolate eggs a 6 out of 10. I feel like that's reasonable. But that's going to do it for this video. Right now I'm enjoying the Canada game. Um, but yeah, today was a good day. It's my first time going to a really big sporting event, like I said earlier, since COVID. And yeah, I honestly had a really fun time. And overall, it was a good day. Hey guys, 
so it's the next day and I thought this video was over. I filmed an outro yesterday. I'm still going to use the same outro for the end of this video, but today my mom bought tickets again, so we're going to watch the men's curling again. Today is Canada versus Sweden. It is the qualifiers, so if they lose, they're out. So it's a tense game, but I'm excited to go again and it should be really fun. So here's that game. <laughs> So they're going to the semifinals, and if they win that game, they'll go to the gold medal game, or if they lose, they'll go to the bronze medal game. So exciting! Let's see how they do. That game is later tonight, but we're probably just gonna watch it on TV. So yeah, that's now I think this is the real end of the video. I'll see you all in the next one.